In this module, we'll discuss updates to the review interface in Server 2022. There are several new features in the platform's document viewing modes and drop-down menus, as well as updates to existing features. We'll also cover updates to the areas relativity refers to as cards and drawers. When reviewing a document, all viewer modes are now displayed at the top of the screen. If a document lacks content for a particular mode, it will be noted. For example, the No Production note displayed on the unproduced document shown. Server 2022 also offers better support for viewing larger files, with a tenfold increase in capacity for both native files and images. In the image viewing mode, the redaction options have been streamlined into two drop-down menus. The first allows a reviewer to select a redaction mode, while the second contains redaction type options. For example, to draw a black redaction over this email's content, first select Basic Redact from the Redaction Mode drop-down. Next, select Black Redaction as the redaction type, then drag the cursor to create the redaction. In the extracted text mode, the tab width and toggle word wrap features can be used to better align text found in spreadsheets without actually altering the underlying text of the document. For example, when viewing the extracted text for this spreadsheet, changing the tab width to very large better aligns the document's content. Toggling the word wrap further improves the readability of this document. Again, the stored document itself will not be altered by these functions. They only affect the way the text is displayed within Relativity. Two new drop-down menus consolidate Document Actions at the top center area of the document header and Review Interface Actions under the gear icon at top right. The options available in these menus may differ depending on your specific permissions in your workspace. Relativity refers to the panels containing the coding layout, related items, and document list as cards that can be expanded or collapsed as needed. For example, if related items such as families or duplicates are important to your review, the card can be toggled on via the arrow icon. The related item can then be switched via the drop-down. When the document list card is expanded, it will contain the same columns that are displayed in the view or save search being used. If the file icon is included in the view, clicking it from within the card will open the record in a separate browser window. And finally, when coding documents, note that the positions of the Save and Next and Save buttons have been swapped. Server 2022 organizes several functions into expandable drawers to either side of the document viewer. On the left side, you'll find toggles for the persistent highlights and thumbnail views, while annotations and contextual search are located on the right side. Navigating persistent highlights has been improved for both highlighting sets and individual terms. The hit count for each term will be displayed with the same text and background colors that the highlighting appears in the document. To access the persistent highlights panel, click the H icon in the top left drawer. Using the next highlight arrow buttons, you can now navigate through term hits for an entire highlight set such as the privilege term set shown here. You can also focus on a single term within a set. Any term hits from recently run saved or ad hoc searches will display beneath the persistent highlighting sets and can be navigated in the same manner. In the lower left drawer, thumbnails are available for paginated records, such as Word documents and PowerPoints. The thumbnail view can quickly be scrolled through to locate term hits and highlighting in native mode, or any redactions present in image mode. Moving to the right side of the document viewing pane, the annotations panel is in the top right drawer. 
In addition to clicking the icon to view a document's hidden content, you can also click the Show These Items link when the orange pop-up appears on a document. Finally, in the lower right drawer, contextual search is now available. This feature allows search terms to be displayed with their surrounding text for each hit within the document. Contextual search will be covered in more depth during the searching module.